Central Washington University projects 17 to 1800 freshmen for the upcoming school year. And while this number is up from the past two years, it is still lower than pre-pandemic enrollment and will take some time to recover. When you bring in small freshman classes, they're with you for a while, and so your total enrollment generally drops for a couple of years. It'll take a while for those small classes to bubble through. With about 50% of the budget coming from the state and 50% from tuition, lower enrollment means some hard choices will have to be made. We've tried really hard to maintain our normal student to faculty ratio of about 20 to 1. So that is that is something that Central has um, had in place for a long time, the, the goal of having a, a low student to faculty ratio. Less students means less professors are needed. This may result in some reduced workloads for non-tenured track staff. So with the budget cuts, and again, this is just the reality of it because NTTs are not on that tenure track line, we don't get that priority. We're gonna be the first ones to get cut, to lose our jobs. That's gonna affect our students. In an effort to increase enrollment, Central plans on taking a different route. Instead of sending emails, texts, and postcards in hopes of recruiting students, Central has launched a more relational approach by building relationships with high school and even middle school counselors. Central Washington University has such incredible depth and quality to the relationships that we establish here on this campus. That's who we are and how we do what we do. That's the magic of Central Washington University. President Wolpart feels it's important to keep the campus and community aware of the decisions and how they may impact Central for the years to come. The thing that has been a little bit different is the way in which we have been very transparent with the projections and the budget and the impact of that because I really do believe in that kind of transparency and the community coming together to think deeply about how we're going to embrace this challenge in front of us. Woolpart says it will take another three to four years for Central to return to their normal enrollment. From CW Campus, Lainey Erickson, Central News Watch.